suppose you have something to say about yesterday. No. Something else, actually. I believe Arthur has told you about some business we're planning, Linda. Oh, there's always business, Thomas. And Arthur believes when this business is done, it'll all be over. Arthur believes you, but I don't. <sighs> Linda, the people who have hired us to rob the factory are very bad people. They'll not pay us as they've promised. So on the night of the robbery, we will take what is ours from their treasury. And a bit more on top for luck. If you're saying you're going to stop Arthur, I need to know. That'll be Arthur's decision. And your plan is still to reform him, eh? To the absolute degree of redemption. Mm -hmm. Well, Arthur will walk away from this with 30,000 pounds. We made a deal. And afterwards, you and Arthur can begin your new life. Did you say 30,000? Arthur said the estimated total proceeds would be 150,000. Estimated, yes. A third of 150 is 50. Why a third? The three brothers, Finn is not yet a man. At our expenses. 25,000, you said. As of last night, the expenses increased. We need to dig a hole. Arthur agreed to a plan with a figure of 25. 25 from 150 is 125. A third of that is 41,000 pounds. <gasps> Sugar? Yes. So, you've worked this all out, I see. Only my head. Haven't written it down. Linda, are you saying... If it were 41,000... I've already told you. That'd be Arthur's decision. But I don't imagine he'll accept less than 41. May I smoke? No. you have some plans for your 41,000. Yes. California. For the child's health, away from the smoke. We want to run a general store on an Indian mission. The Americans invite Quakers to do good work with the Indians. We've already sent our papers and been accepted. <laughs> Arthur Shelby as a missionary. Yeah. Arthur will run the store. Mm. I will teach in the school next to it. Arthur will swim in the ocean. I will be on the beach with a towel. The open air and the sun will get rid of all the nonsense in his head from France. That's some plan. As you know yourself, the arrival of a new life concentrates the mind on practical things. Amen to that. When is the child due? September. When is the robbery? June. Then the timing's perfect. We'll book a passage to the Panama Canal the day after the 41,000's paid to Arthur. <coughs> Did we agree 41,000, Linda? I heard nothing to the contrary. 